For thee. Ah, now, Jove, in his next commodity of hair, send thee a beard. <laughs> By my troth, I tell thee I am almost sick for one. <laughs> so I would not have it grow on my chin. <laughs> is the lady with him? Our lady is within, sir. We will construe to them whence you come. Who you are and what you would are out of our welcome. <laughs> <laughs> These fellows are wise enough to play the fool. Gentlemen. And you, sir? Ah, most excellent, accomplished lady. Um, the heavens rain odors on you. <laughs> Use a rare courtier. Ring the doors well. Let the garden door be shut and leave me to my hearing. Give me your hand, sir. My duty, madam, and most humble service. <laughs> what is your name? Cesario is your servant's name, fair princess? My servant, sir. <laughs> your servant in the Count Orsino, you. And he is yours. And his needs must be yours. Your servant's servant, <coughs> madam. For him, I think not on him. For his thoughts when they were blanks rather than filled with me. Madam, I come to wet your gentle thoughts on his behalf. By your leave, I pray you, uh, I beg you never speak again of him. But if you were to undertake another suit, I had rather hear you to solicit that than music from the spheres. My lady, uh, give me leave, beseech you. I did send, after the last enchantment, you did hear a ring in chase of you. So did I abuse myself, my servant, and I fear me you. I pity you. That's a degree to love. No. <laughs> For very oft we pity enemies. Why then methinks tis time to smile again. <laughs> not afraid, good you. I will not have you. <laughs> and yet, when wit and youth is come to harvest, your were is like to reap a proper man. <laughs> there lies your way. Do us. Oh! Faith, I will 
not stay a jot longer. I reason, dear Venom. Give thy reason. You must needs yield your reason, Sir Andrew. I saw your niece bestowing more favors upon the Count's serving man than ever she bestowed upon me. You saw it in the orchard. Um, <clears throat> why then, uh, build me thy fortunes upon the basis of valor. Challenge me, the Count's youth, to fight with him. Hurt him in eleven places. Oh, my niece will take note of it, and assure thyself. There is no love broker in the world can more prevail in men's combination with women than report of valor. Uh, well, will either of you bear me a challenge to him? I'll go, write it in martial hand. Be cursed and brief. Taunt him with the license of ink. Where shall I find him? I will call thee. Go! strike him. But if she does, he'll smile and take it for a great favor. <laughs> <laughs>